Today we are hooking up a manometer to a gas furnace. This is an old 80% gas furnace, Snyder General. There is our output for our manifold side. The manifold is right here where our burners are at. So I'm going to take this off with a service tool, which is commonly used in HVAC for all sorts of things, including service valves for refrigerant. I'm going to loosen that up and I'll show you what we do next. There's our fitting that comes off the gas valve. We will use a fitting that comes with a manometer to put in its place so we can test gas pressure. Here's the piece that goes in that same location. I'm going to put this on and a hose will fit over the top of this barb and we can hook it up to our manometer which is a field piece manometer. Here's our hose. We're going to put it onto that barb here. My manometer, I'm going to zero it out. It's field piece SDMN5. Then we can hook this up to the barb on top of the manometer. And now when I start the furnace up, I'll be able to check the pressure. We have the manometer hooked up to the port on the gas valve, measuring our discharge pressure from the gas valve. So next I'm going to drill a hole for the, actually I already have a hole up here for the combustion test. I'll get it ready so I can mount the 320, test 320 in place, start things up and see how everything is running. Test 320 is set up. Haven't started it yet. Manometer set up. We're going to turn everything on, get things going so we can see how everything looks. The propane gas valve conversion says 11 inches of water column. It's sort of their guide. We're going to let it run for a few minutes and see if we're still running high on oxygen. Right now we're at 10%. We'll let it level out over about 10, 15 minutes and we'll see where we end up as far as temperature spread and all that before we go adjusting the valve up any farther. Alright guys, you can see it. Just over 10 inches of water on the gas pressure. Numbers a little bit high on oxygen, not that high though. Just right shade above normal, so I'm gonna leave it where it's at. You know, the machine's looking really good. The machine physically looks really good as well, so I got no problem with that. We got a rise of around let's see, 77.6 or 78. At 133, we got about 55 degrees rise there. So looking pretty good. I'm gonna shut this thing down before we boil everybody inside. And call this one good.